So Custom Wood Designs all began back in 2010 um, when I lost my job after the recession here. I was, I was a building site carpenter. I lost my job, um, which I actually thought was a good thing at the time. Uh, I've always been big interested in, 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 in woodcraft and um, always actually wanted to be my own boss as well. I started uh, carving wooden signs. I watched a lot of videos on YouTube, um, learned how to carve small timber signs where, where I actually started selling them in the markets on the weekends. I used to travel around all the local markets making signs there and then for people while they waited and there was a huge amount of interest in this type of thing. Uh, there was nobody else really doing it so um, I was very busy in the markets for a couple of years. Um, we sat in Claudia, my partner, who's uh, an artist and a designer. Um, bet between us together we had a huge amount of ideas for all sorts of new products and services that basically weren't available in Ireland. So we decided to upscale. We had an idea to build our own shop um, on a busy, in a busy location, uh, but in order to do this we needed funding. So we went and had a chat with South Dublin Local Enterprise Office, and after meeting with them and discussing our plans, they gave us all the information we needed to actually put a proper business plan together. They even assigned me to a mentor, uh, a business mentor, Patrick Meenan, an amazing man with a wealth of knowledge in the business world. So after dealing with Patrick, um, over, over about two years, it took me basically between work and uh, keeping up with orders. So it was about two years altogether in order to write the 50 page business plan, but it was all worth it in the end. Um, we were eventually awarded a business primer grant from, from uh, our local enterprise office with um, a microfinance business loan as well to help fund all of this. We are now 18 months in our new building. We've basically converted a, a, an old hay barn into a shop and a fully operational workshop. Um, we're getting lots of new past trade here on the Blessington Road, we're in the Sagard area. And we're now doing work for the likes of IKEA, uh, Facebook through Oigate Office, we're doing shop displays for Kyo's Crisps. We, 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 we do all sorts of trophies and awards, we're even doing um, event props and, and, and um, display work now for, for, for a lot of big event companies around Ireland. Um, our service is mainly based on timber sign work, we do a lot of commercial sign work, shop fronts, we do a lot of 3D sculpture work, we do um, directional and, um, and, and interpretive signage all around the parks for, the, for councils all over Ireland. We are able to build our own um, show, showroom which we never had before, um, our workshop and also uh, purchase some new machinery. So we now have the capacity to actually take on more work. Um, we're, we're, we're doing a lot of work now for, for much bigger clients. We, still, we, we have storage. So the funding and the mentoring was actually a huge help to us. Um, it basically made our dreams come true. 